for John to come home as the city burned on all around. With one hand on the tiller and another around her, he sails her off into the sound. Oh, John, he was a sailor in the waters. Kelly Wersner, the finest fiddle player in all the land. Give her some love. Aaron Brule on the djembe and the heartbeat. My name is Clint McCune, and it's such a pleasure to be here tonight. I got one more song for you, and then we'll take a little break, sell some CDs, put Kevin and Makia and the crew to work for another round of coffee. And then we'll be back for another round of music and probably play till midnight. Shh, don't tell Kevin. <laughs> Crazy tuning. Uh, I'm in standard tuning through the night and then now going to an open E tune. Which scares Gelly so much she won't even play on it. That's why she. <laughs> Gelly and I are going to be living in a van for a month. We survived it last time, too. We are actually really good traveling partners. The ones that get rowdy are Gelly's two dachshunds that come along. And they don't lift shit. They don't, talk, they don't like do nothing. They're like, uh, I'm just saying. We snuggle with them in the back, but they're not good roadies, is what I'm trying to say. <laughs> they can't carry anything. Not even a microphone. We tried to strap on a microphone, and that didn't. We'll be playing this Sunday out at Oak Harbor Music Festival, which is this incredible music festival. It's in its fourth year. It's started by um, Craig Larson and Taylor Larson's uncle. And um, and this year, it's like three days, and the headlining act on Saturday night is one of my favorite musicians, um, Willie Nelson's son. Lucas Nelson and his band Promise of the Real. If you haven't checked out or knew that Willie Nelson had a son that, that played music, don't worry. It's exactly what you want Willie Nelson's son to play. It's like you're like, phew, you could definitely tell his guitar was like the teething ring. We'll be playing Sunday there in Oak, Har uh, in Oak Harbor at high noon. Play one more song, take a little break. This one goes out to Mama Earth. And I love her so I wouldn't trade her for gold Walking on moonbeams. Well, I was born with a silver spoon. And I'm gonna be me. What I can be. When I'm walking on. Stare it out. 
staring out to see. Better be you. Do what you can do. When you're walking on moonbeams, staring out to see. And if a door be closed, then a road. Of home start building. Tear your curtains down. For sunlight is like gold. You better be true. Do what you can. When you're holding on to moonbeams, staring out, staring out. I love her so I wouldn't trade her for By heaven, the stars, the moon, and the sun. By heaven, the stars, the moon, and the sun. Come on, mama, look what has been done. You can only see the stars after the setting sun. You run for the money you don't even know about wild mountain honey. On Papa, your end is the means. Don't trade your love and goodness for the golden machine. You run for the money. You don't even know about wild mountain honey.
See you in 10 minutes, guys. Got new CDs for sale.
sort of met Dakota, introduced by Minnesota. I, I just smiled. She was six feet tall. She said she, she hated these walls. These walls we stepped outside for a day. Why? She, she wore a plain green dress. Said it was cold and it was, it was best. She should be running. She kissed my ear. My ear said, said my beer. Come see me soon. Naked I am. Six guns, keep them loaded, said Dakota. And when you do come, bring your six guns, keep them loaded, said Dakota. I said, one of these days, one of these days, one of these Six guns, keep them loaded, said Dakota. 
up here instead Walk in with me towards a midnight swim I can give you, baby, what you can't get from him Songbirds singing in an old dead tree The way you drive, honey, scares the hell out of me Hundred miles an hour on the brand new road Look at me again, you'll make my heart explode Hey, hey, little fighter girl It's you and me up against this whole wide world Sleeping together in the lion's den Got your earrings in my pocket till I see you again A bicycle bell, dogs are barking as the kingdom fell. In its place stood a golden town where people walk without touching the ground. Hey, hey, little fighter girl, it's you and me now against this whole wide world. Sleeping together in the lines, then, baby, I can sleep it on till I see you again.
always watched you so close. So you do this right. Only hopes she beats them. She beats the pearls dry. She's left with nothing. Only her dreaming. Reflections haunted to sky. What can she do? Wash clothes for Why can she run away? She dives into the river and goes out to the ocean. philosopher meditating on purple dates. I can be frank about it. It's legal. I got very little time. I'm looking to find some reason up in the material world, and I got my Hawkeye set on rhythm and rhyme. Now I truly see that my environment is just a grand reflection of me. Earth, sky, and sea, universal energy in all the physical matter. It all comes together to help I and I climb the life condition ladder. From hell to Buddhahood, I write by my altar, burning log, champa, sage, and sandalwood, and it is all good, for I found my peace of mind. Meditating with rhythm has brought me to the highest vibration, the purest kind. Raise your spirits, and you too will find that you are as strong as the all-growth tree. If you don't believe me, try it. You ain't even got to buy it. Yo, it's free, ageless energy. Lights are pumping, 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 pumping. Into white light, all things running, 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 running. Who am I been? Who am I becoming? Coming, 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 coming. Deep breaths for a young man, learning, 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 learning. Take a walk with the cedars humming, cityscaping, sunset stunning. Every fire kindle burning, every empty space is filled. I believe in the good things coming, coming, 
come in, come in, say, I am no master, I know nothing. Sing. I am no master, I know nothing. I am no master, I know nothing. I am no master, I know nothing. But I am a servant and I know something. I am no master, I know nothing. Definitely still young. Built on hunger and so fucking stubborn. A lot of self work undone. But I am a witness. Uh huh, uh huh. Like the one who carries all the secrets in the music, 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 music. Oh, oh, oh. Hey, hey, oh, oh, oh. oh, oh, oh. oh, 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 Story. More grace, more meaning unfolding. Take a ride, bring part Cascadia. Feel the warmth in my cold heart radiant. Two shakes and I'm feeling weightless. Heartaches, but it's actually painless. Take a bow in the Pele moonlight, 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 moonlight. Take a look at myself through my third eye, third eye, third eye, third eye, third eye. Everything's already alright. Always alright, always alright. I'm back at the From the center within Sharp but smooth to the touch Of my red long lion's mane It's part of my makeup Uh-huh, uh-huh Never mind the nightmares Always gonna wake up, wake up, wake up, wake up Oh, Your sweet ass, I will drop that shit right then. I might be busy, uh huh, uh huh. But I've always got some time to surrender to your beauty, 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 beauty. Oh.
I love hearing your voices.
brand new moon, brand new sun. Mr. Aaron Brule on the djembe and Gelly Wurzner on the violin. Yeah. My name is Clint, and I was saying that I lived in Winthrop when I was 18, before, after high school, took a year off before going to college. And in Winthrop, man, being a man is being a man, and we used to go into bars just for the intention of having bar fights because it was Friday night, 
And this is before Netflix. Um, <laughs> And the ranchers, us, us ranchers, were getting fights with the farmers, and we could take them. But when the um, smoke jumpers would come into the bar, boy, we'd clear out. They could take all of us down. Toughest dudes to be able to jump out of an airplane with an ax, to fight fire that way, to the firefighters. Well, we got it in us, me and our crew from the ranch, to go down to OMAC to go be part of something called the OMAC Stampede. H have any of you heard of that? Yeah. Right? The greatest horse race in the history of the world happens in OMAC, toughest. And so craziest, my buddy, he signed up to race and we were his crew. And as we were getting ready for the race, he shaved his head, that was a sign. We, we spent a month uh, making what would be a switch for your uh, horse. Uh, but it was like wrapped with a steel and duct tape and made into like a baton. And then we put face paint on, like war paint. So did everybody else. And we, the race is like this football field, the length that the horses start at a full gallop. By the time they get the end of the football field, it drops off to this sheer cliff down a couple of football fields. Like, a, I don't know, a big, big cliff. I don't know how long it is. But then right into a rushing river. And then uh, a river too deep for the horses to, so they got to swim. And then up the other side into the fairgrounds. The whole time, no rules. You can beat the other riders. You can uh, do whatever you can to get them off their horses. And it's a fight of uh, manhood. It was a rite of passage in that, in the Okanagan Valley. That's how tough they took their traditions and what it meant to be men. Where were the women? Well, I mean, because of the, <laughs> right. The women were, thought it was ridiculous <laughs> that we were <laughs> doing all of this. Um, <laughs> Oh my God, right? Oh, there we go. <laughs> They're home making fiddles. I was 18. I saw him take off down the cliff. It's like this fall that you do on your horse. are flowing run across the valley beneath the sacred mountains wander through the forest the trees have leaves of prisms that break the light in colors that no one knows the names of nobody knows not me or you
And she may beg and she may plead And she may argue with her logic And tell me all the things I lose I really have no value In the end she'll surely know I wasn't born to follow Imagine the moment breaking out through the silence, all the things that we both might say. In our hearts, they will not be denied until we're both on the same damn side, and the future is here today.
Mr. Aaron Brule of the gym bay. That's why we're taking him on the road, y'all. Oh my gosh. Is... How'd he do in the race? He's still alive. I'm proud to say. <laughs> um, is uh, Chiopton still here? Are you out there? Chiopton. Yeah, good. A good friend of mine and a brother in the neighborhood here, another local boy who's been such an ally to this place, to Soul Food, to the Soul Tribe since the very beginning of it. He plays his concerts here. He tells his stories here. He sells his drums and his flutes here. He's an incredible artist, human being, and activist who is always on the f uh, front line of uh, raising a voice and being the first one to pray and get everybody together. Um, please welcome to our stage Mr. Paul Wagner, Mr. Chilkton. <laughs> Try not to step on any of these uh, fancy pedals up here. <laughs> you never know what'd come out. It might sound like Jimi Hendrix. I might <laughs> need some lighter fluid. <laughs> so how's everyone doing? All right, what a beautiful night. These guys, they're amazing. Wow, what a good feeling. Give them a hand again. It's always a, a good feeling that comes out from their music and from their soul, from the words that they give inside the music and in between the music. So I'm happy to be here. Um, my traditional name is Chiokten. I'm from Saanich Nation. I'll go ahead and share a little story with you. Um, this is a real quick little story. We'll go ahead and share a, a real small one. Uh, one of our old people, late Taksha Blue, Vi Hilbert. Can you say Taksha Blue? <laughs> That's her traditional name. And uh, she was such a dear person. She was really bossy, and she'd get up and tell stories, and she would say, I'm a bossy old woman, and I have seven lovers. That's the first thing she'd tell people. <laughs> and so everyone would be laughing at her, and, but she's so beautiful, and she shared so much love from her heart, you know. And they say that when people leave this world, they say that they don't really leave this world until the last person who loves them leaves this world. So I know that she will be here for a long time because she carries so much love and shared so much goodness with so many people. Anyway, thanks for saying her name. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and share a real short story. She said that even a small story with a few lines carries a great weight, a great strength. So in this very short story, I'm going to have you say Habu. Could you say Habu? Habu. Because where we're at here... We're in the land of the Stokwalbius. Could you say Stokwalbius? Stokwalbius. Anyone know the translation of Stokwalbius? <laughs> How about the modern way to say Stokwalbius? Stokwalbius? Yeah, Stokwalbi, you got it, right on. That's where we live. We live in the land of the Stokwalbi people, but their old name is Stokwalbius. So say it one more time, Stokwalbius. Stokwalbi. All right, now we all know. people. That was before I was really getting into my culture. But now we know. Each and every one of you knows now. So let people know. It's true. We should know. We should let people know. And uh, anyway, so the story is uh, just that's the language. When you're listening to a story from this land here, they would say habu when they hear silence. So make sure you say that. That's your part for now. Just say habu. Long, long ago, lay a tool away over there. Long ago, the mountains thought they were people. Long, long ago. They will say, long, long, long ago, the human beings thought they were people, and that is all. 
Well, that'll give you something to think about. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. It makes you think. And that's the point behind these stories. Anyway, so that's a short story right there. Very short. Um, I don't know what we're going to do next, but thanks for listening to my words. Uh, leave a little bit of something for you. She's in the night.
Chiokten. Let's hear a habu for Chiokten. <laughs> I love you so much. I'm so glad to be from here and to be in the same neighborhood and tribe and species. And I just want you to know that. Thanks for showing up tonight just for the story. So many good friends are here tonight. I love you so much. I can't tell you how much. Over the years of being from here, raised here, <laughs> my kids are here. And I would like to say it's past their bedtime, but it's not. <laughs> right? I learned that I'm not from the family I was born in. I learned I was the family of you. Through the years here, from Sarah and I first building this place all those years ago, staying open for Christmases, Christmas Eve dinners here for anyone who didn't have a place, shining a light for artists, local artisans, to try to put money into local artists' hands. Can you believe that? A place where you could be proud to be from Before we have uh, helped with the Oso oh mudslide a few years ago, we've helped out with um, climate change going to Mount Everest, community supported. I love you, and I feel like we can make a difference. Thank you so much for being here tonight. <laughs> Ask for what you really want. Don't go back to sleep. People are going back and forth across the dorsal where the two worlds touch, and the door is round and open. Don't go back to sleep. Inside us is a secret, a promise to keep. Don't go back to sleep But the door is round and open And the river's so deep Give me back tomorrow Taking all that I can stand Throw the weight of the world From the palm of your hand Gather round the fire Together we will rise Keep your feet on the ground your eye on the prize. Oh, turn away. No, don't go back. Next train's coming down the track. Whoever you are, whatever it takes, we will stand free and we will stay your way. This is a secret, a promise to keep. Don't go back to sleep. The door is round and open, and the river's so deep. Find your place in the world, throw your dreams to the sky. Be my beloved and I'll be your most high. We'll stay up all night and we'll howl loud our tune. Getting chased by the moon named you. No. Don't turn away, no, no, don't go back. Next train's coming down the track. Whoever you are, whatever it takes. Stand free and we will stay away. Go back to sleep. Inside us 
by fear don't know where to go or which way to steer give respect to all give thanks for the day we'll sing and we'll dance we'll eat and we'll pray oh. don't turn away no. don't go my hack next train's coming down the track whether you Miss Gelly Wersner on the violin, Aaron Brule on the djembe, John and Julie on the sound, Chris and Ryan, the brothers on the bar over there, Kevin, Makia, thank you so much for this place. Yeah. And who is the new girl? Savannah? Savannah, stand, okay, Savannah, stand up. Everybody, this is Savannah. Savannah, this is everybody. My gosh, it's been an incredible night tonight connecting in. I've been playing the first Friday of the month for like 15 years here, and then the uh, five years, for a few years before then at uh, Victor's. Before then at Starbucks when it was like a small one place. Uh, <laughs> I grew up playing music in coffee shops. And uh, for the last few years, I've been hitting it hard as I can as a musician. That's my day job. It's, and at the same time that it feels amazing, amazing to say, I am a musician. When someone asks you, what do you do? I'm a musician. And then they say, no, seriously, what do you do? I say, no, seriously, I'm a musician in my family and I believe in it. And we all make this promise to make our way through the world doing what we do best. So I got to say that uh, in the tour that's coming up in the month ahead and then bigger shows and an album, a new album that we are, will be starting right when the tour gets over to release sometime in February, March with a release date flirting with a release at the Triple Door. I know, I know. Things are growing and changing. And so I wanted to make tonight the last official first Friday of the month and then come back in a few months, plan a nice night with Kevin to come back and, and rock it out. And, um, and, uh, but that will allow us to be able to tour more and get further out. And this, these little walls of my songs have been growing. There's a way to connect with me online. I've been connecting in with other communities and, and connecting in with you guys in other places and other things. And, so I want to just, uh, it's been this like train for the last decade more of, uh, of going further and I believe that uh, we are. And so I wanted to say that and play one more sweet song for soul food and then um, talk to Kevin about booking up a gig in the spring, Kevin. I wrote this one. I wrote this one for Clapton. 
I've never loved a place more in my whole fucking life. This place. The weekend that we built this stage, I wrote the word hope underneath this piece of wood here so that it would stay hidden in the walls. And <laughs> feel like it worked. I got so lost that I went to church. Sorry, God, but you made it worse. <laughs> made me sit there behind a fence. I was haunted by all the evidence. I guess you don't want me to think. So instead, I will dream and drink. Got you drunk to drive home in the cab. I grabbed my phone and made a call I might regret to a girl that I just met. Lately things are not okay. I just wanted to hear somebody say, if you need a reason as to why you're here, you don't need to look farther than me. Oh. As to why you're here, you don't need to look farther than me. Isn't that appropriate? Isn't that just. Hold, hold on, 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 over the place this hell a frozen glance how could i let this moment pass lately things are not okay i just wanted to hear somebody say if you need a reason as to why you're here you don't need to look farther than me Sorry, God, but you made it worse. Made me sit there behind a fence. I saw it by all the evidence. I guess you don't want me to think. So instead, I will dream and drink. Got too drunk to drive home in the cab. I grabbed my phone, made a call I might regret to a girl that I just met. Lately things are not okay. I just wanted to hear somebody say, sing with me. If you need a reason as to why you're here, you don't need to look farther than me. Beautiful, keep singing. If you need a reason as to why you're here, don't need to look farther than me. Some more. Don't need to look farther than me. I can see you. I can always see you. 
Thank you very much. Thank you very much. I... Yeah, Makanda, Lori, Mr. Man. Yay! We play it better play another damn song. Aaron Gelly, get up here. Let's play it outright. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I was serious about midnight.
that you gave me and I believe in the faith that can raise me and I believe and I hope and I pray one day this may raise me above these bad lands. Love you guys. Gelly Wurzner on the violin, Aaron Brule. My name is Clint. I'd like to stay friends with you. Check out our CDs. Get one. Bring one home tonight if you don't have one. We have our newest album out. Just released tonight, our live disc. Love you. <laughs>